Hello and welcome to Cracksoid. Today in this video, I am going to give you the review of latest alpha droid version 1.2.1 which is based on Android 13. I'll also cover all of its new features, customizations, Antutu benchmark score, Geekbench 5 and 6 score, CPU throttling test result and many more of this official alpha droid ROM. So let's start. So as you can see this is Redmi Note 8 device and I have installed latest official alpha droid 1.2.1 which is running on Android version 13 and has the Android security update of February 5, 2023. And if you look at its kernel version, Quicksilver kernel is used in this room. User experience. Talking about the user experience of this room, this room is extremely quick and responsive. You won't feel any lags like other rooms while using this room as you can see the smoothness of this room. I'm not facing any slowdowns while scrolling and swiping over the screen and you can see the app opening and closing speed as well. I find this room really fast. Tell me in the comment section how is the smoothness and app opening closing speed of this room. Antutu benchmark score. Moving towards some benchmark scores, I'll start with Antutu benchmark and you can see the score on the screen which is 207246 and this is a pretty good score because in my recent review video on latest Evolution Act 7.7 .7 ROM on Redmi Note 8, the Antutu score was 204186. Geekbench 5 score. Moving towards next test, I'll showcase the result of Geekbench 5 and as you can see the score for single core is 297 and score for multi core is 1256. And if we compare this score with the latest Evolution Axe 7.7, .7, then the scores on Evolution Axe ROM were 298 and 1262 for single core and multi core respectively. Geekbench 6 score. Now talking about the result of Geekbench 6 test, for single core the score is 319 and for multi core the score is 1162. And in Evolution Act 7.7 .7, the score was 319 and 1155 respectively. CPU throttling test. So now let's see the results of CPU throttling test. I have done this test for straight 15 minutes and you can see the result on the screen. The CPU has throttled to 95% of its maximum performance and the average score is 142867 GIPS. And in Evolution Act 7.7, .7, the CPU has throttled to 93% of its maximum performance and the average score was 139581. Safety net status. Now let's see safety net test result and it has passed the safety net compatibility test and if we look at play protect certification on Google Play Store app, the device is certified as well. Wallpapers and styles. Moving towards wallpapers and styles section, you will get both wallpaper colors and basic colors option and other additional features like dark theme, themed icons, app grid, system icon packs and system fonts are also available. And inside app grid, up to 6 into 10 sized grid is present. Camera Talking about camera, this room comes with aperture camera where photo, video and scan mode is available and from this camera you can take video up to 4K at 60 FPS. Launcher Moving towards launcher, this room comes with alpha launcher and from its recent app section you can get options like app info, kill, split top, on install and freeform. And if you look down below you will get quick action buttons like screenshot, pin app and clear all. Furthermore you can customize it according to your choice from its home screen setting and from miscellaneous you can access to use taskbar as well as to hidden and protected apps feature. And from recent option you can even add one more button and that is lens option. Quick settings. So this is how quick setting panel looks like and you will get some useful tiles like scan QR code, compass, volume panel, screenshot, sound search, MI sound enhancer and more. Settings. Now let's see what's inside its settings section and explore latest features and customizations available in alpha droid settings section. And as you can also see the user interface of this settings section is really unique than other custom rooms. Private DNS. From network and internet settings, you can access to private DNS option and in this private DNS, you can also find 5 different DNS provider which you can use just by tapping on it. Battery Along with network and internet, there is battery setting attached together and inside battery, there are 6 different options available like battery uses, smart charging, smart cutoff, battery saver, 
battery manager, battery optimization and one battery overlay for current battery temperature. Display. In its display setting, you can find screen timeout option with maximum time limit of 30 minutes and also screen attention option is given here. And below you will find a dark theme option which has only one custom theme and that is pure black. You can apply and use it from here. Xiaomi parts. Xiaomi parts option in this room is shifted towards system setting and from here you can get options like MI sound enhancer, clear speaker, display color calibration, LCD features, ambient display gestures and vibration control. Alphabet. In this alpha droid room you will also get an alphabet section from where you can customize your phone according to your choice. Like from its user interface option you can change setting style between AOSP, DOT and NAD NAD which will completely change the look of setting section as you can also see on the screen. Not only setting style you can also change UI style to 10 different options which will also change the look of setting section by changing the user interface and all of them are different from each other. Similarly you will also get advanced monet settings from where you can play with colors and can also choose theme styles to 8 different options which was not present in its display setting. Similarly you can do tons of customizations in different sector of your phone like on status bar quick settings, buttons, lock screen, notifications, navigation, sound and miscellaneous. And from miscellaneous you can access to game space feature, unlock higher FPS in games, unlimited photo storage, Netflix spoof, ignore secure window flag, parallel space, swipe to take screenshot weather settings and many more and when you swipe three fingers down to take screenshot you will get share edit delete and partial screenshot option but google lens is missing in it so this is all about the latest alpha droid room based on android version 13 basically this room is based on popular cr droid room which is known for its stability and customizations Additionally, some of the performance optimization in Alpha Droid ROM have been ported from other custom ROMs like Rise Droid and Proton AOSP which are known for their speed and efficiency. In addition, the developer of Alpha Droid have picked extra features from other custom ROMs and adapted them to their needs. This Alpha Droid ROM has significantly improved in terms of speed and offers a smooth user experience. Personally, I enjoyed using this ROM and recommend it for daily use. You too can give it a try and see the difference. Thank you so much for watching this video and if you liked our video then don't forget to hit the like button, comment down below, share this video and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Also hit the notification bell. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.